It might actually sink. No problem. Well, I was sinking. So adding some flotation to the Barbie Jeep, so adding a boogie board to the bottom of it, having to cut out around the tires, using a jigsaw to cut around it, and a razor blade knife. Be careful with a razor blade knife, you will cut yourself. Alright, let's see how it turns out. I got one side to fit the way I like it. It's going to fit in here, got a notch out for the motor, it's going to fit pretty low. Got enough room for the wheels to turn. So. Now I'm going to measure off on the other side and do the same cut. I'm not really concerned about it being perfect, just want it to float. Alright, so I cut it out. I think it's going to work well. Um, I did notice that I didn't need this notch cut for the gearboxes. It's narrow enough to fit through there. The one thing I don't like is this footwell here for the gas pedal. So I'm going to cut that off and cover it with duct tape for right now. I can eventually weld in some plastic and fix that so that it's actually a better... Here you can see the steering wheel mechani uh, steering mechanism. Zip ties for the wind. Here's the piece I cut out. I used the Sawzall. The reciprocating saw for other people that don't call them that. And I used duct tape to cover the hole with just a temporary solution. I'll weld in something to fill it in permanently so that it'll be more rigid. So the idea is really not to make the Barbie Jeep completely buoyant with the Jeep itself. The idea is that the boogie board or knee board will help with buoyancy and with the tires will keep it afloat and do pretty well. Maybe even tackle some waves. We'll see how it goes. But uh, I think it's coming along pretty well. I think the ideal idea is solid. But, you know, time will tell when I get ready to test it. Okay, it's bolted on. I think it turned out pretty good. Got six bolts holding it in. Two in the front, two in the middle, and then two in the back. I follow the curve. That'll help it be able to conquer waves if it runs into any of them. And uh, we're fixing the, we're about to try it out. Fixing it is a southern term. But yeah, we'll see how it turns out. Wow, it's so much faster now, and it doesn't look like it's going to sink either. Hey, we hope you enjoyed the video, and it will inspire you to make modifications to your own Power Wheels project. Please like the video and make a comment on it, because this is how YouTube's algorithm determines the priority of videos that it presents to its viewers.